in this video I want to show how you can add, subtract, multiply uh, integers and that's one skill uh, students need to have and be confident in especially when you're graphing uh, equations and you have to plot points so let's take some simple examples okay so what if uh, Okay, so let's take a simple example. So, negative 4 plus 1. So, what does this mean? You are adding 1 to negative 4. So, adding, when you're adding numbers, uh, you are going to the right. So, I'll show you how you can do this on a number line so you can visually see what's happening. So what you're saying is, this is your starting point, so let me write SP starting point, and then you're going 1 to the right. So this is negative 4, and if you go 1 to the right, you reach negative 3, so the answer is negative 3. So remember, that when you're adding an integer, you're going to the right, and if you're taking away or subtracting, you're going to the left. So what would happen if it is a negative 4 take away 1? Well, that is from negative 4 again you start at negative 4. You're starting at negative 4 and you're going 1 to the left. So your answer is negative 5. So let me show this on a calculator. Uh, so it's always good to check as you go. So negative 4 plus 1 is negative 3 and negative 4 take away 1 is negative 5 okay so let's do a few more examples what will happen if it is uh, negative 5 take away 8 okay well uh, instead of negative 8 so let me put negative 4 so from negative 5, you're starting at negative 5, so you're starting at negative 5, so this is your starting point, and you're going 4 to the left, so count 1, 2, 3, 4, so you reach here, so the answer is negative 9. What would happen if it is negative 5 plus 4? You're going to the right now, so from negative 5, this is negative 5 and you're going 4 to the right 1 2 3 4 you're reaching positive 1 or negative 1 sorry okay so let me again show this on a calculator so for those who are struggling always try to do it without a calculator and then you can check it on a calculator that's how you learn so negative 5 take away 4 is negative 9 and negative 5, sorry, negative 5 plus 4 is negative 1. Okay, so uh, let's put, uh, let's do a few more questions. What if it is negative 9 plus 7? So let's do without, a, without doing, looking at the number line. So you start at negative 9 and you're going 7 steps to the right. So try to do it without a calculator or without looking at the number line. So I hope you understand that should be negative 2. So again, you can go back, always go back to the number line. Yeah, this is negative 9. You're going 7 to the right. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Which is negative 2. Uh, what if it is 9 take 9, uh, sorry, if it is negative 7 plus 9 negative 7 plus 9 you're starting at negative 7 and you're going 9 steps to the right I hope you can see if you count 9 steps to the right you'll reach at 2 okay so let's do examples of multiplying so let me again show this on a calculator so negative 9 plus 7 and negative 7 plus 9 negative 7 plus 9 
is plus 2. So I would put up some questions now. I would like you to do this yourself and I'll put the answers up later on. So you can pause this video and then try to answer the questions yourself. Hopefully you've done the answer. I'll write the answers and then you can mark yourself. So negative 1, negative 4 plus 1 is negative 3. Negative 1, this would be negative 3. This is negative 8. This is negative 9. You're starting at 9 and going 10 steps to the left which is negative 1 this is this and this are basically the same 9 take away 10 or negative 10 plus 9 are basically the same and this is negative 6 okay so now let's do when you got positive and negative okay are two negatives or two positives what will happen if it is two times now, if you've got two negatives, suppose if it is 2 take away minus 4. So you're taking away a negative. When you're taking away negative, means you're adding. So this is same as 2 plus 4, which is 6. So let me show this on a calculator. So you can just add, go in the calculator. 2 take away negative 4 is positive 6. Okay, so what if negative 2 take away minus 8? Now this again taking away negative means to add. So this is negative 2 plus 8. And negative 2 plus 8 is basically 8 take away 2. And 8 take away 2 is 6. So again good to check your, on your calculator. Negative 2 take away negative 8 is plus 6. What if you have a plus and a negative? So let's take minus 4 plus minus 5. So adding a negative means you're taking away. You should be taking away. Taking away negative means to add and adding a negative means to take away. So this is negative 4 take away 5. And from negative 4, you're taking away 5. So again, you can look at the number line from negative 4. You're going 5 to the left. So that will be negative 9. So again, let me sh show you that on the calculator. Negative 4 plus negative 5 is negative 9. Okay, so what if it is 7 plus minus 8? So again, adding a negative means taking away, which is 7 minus 8. And 7 take away 8 is negative 1. So always good to check. 7 plus negative 8 is negative 1. Okay, so let's do some examples of multiplying and uh, subtracting or adding. Okay, what will happen if it is 2 times negative 1 plus 4. So here you have to use the bed mass rule. You have to always first multiply and then add. So 2 times negative 1. So this is again a good rule to remember. When it multiplying numbers, positive times positive ends up with a positive. Negative times negative is a positive. 
if you have a positive times negative it is negative and negative times positive is negative so basically if you got two same signs and you're multiplying two numbers with the same signs the final answer will be positive and if you've got two numbers with different so with again the same signs negative and negative becomes positive and if you have two numbers with different signs the final answer would be negative so this is plus two times negative one that is negative two plus four and negative two plus four is same as four take away two which is two okay or negative from negative 2 you're going 4 to the right 1 2 3 4 you're reaching at positive 2 so again check it on a calculator cancel this 2 times negative 1 plus 4 is plus 2 okay so what if it is negative 5 times negative 1 plus Okay, so you got a negative times negative is a positive. So two negatives, you're multiplying two negative numbers. So that becomes plus 5 plus 8. And this should not be difficult, which is 30. What if it is negative 6 times 2 take away 4? Again, you got a negative times positive would give you negative 12 take away 4 so from negative 12 you're going 4 to the left that is negative 16 